Good evening, everyone. I'm Katie Moore. And I'm Sharice Gibson. Now, as we begin hurricane season, renters in Louisiana may be getting some new legal protections. Mm -hmm. now, there's a bill on the governor's desk that would punish bad landlords who try to change the locks or throw out renters' things while they've evacuated for storms. It's in response to a story Eyewitness News first told you about back in September after Hurricane Ida. That's when the out-of-state owners of a HOMA apartment complex almost immediately kicked out residents who had nowhere to go. Our coverage after Hurricane Ida helped to bring the issue to light and now potentially change the law in Louisiana. Devin Bartolotta has been following this story since the beginning. If the governor signs this bill into law, it would better protect every renter in the state of Louisiana and could be the difference between having a roof over their head or not after a storm. When we first introduced you to Ben Toops in September of last year, he was in a tough place. I never thought living in an apartment that I can get an email and I'm gone. He'd stayed for Hurricane Ida. His apartment wasn't damaged and he was being intimidated and evicted anyway by out of state landlords with nowhere to go. We were forced. We had literally no choice. Ten months later, he and his wife are settling into their newly built home in Denham Springs. I miss Homa. I really do. And Toops may have helped change the law for renters like him. I'm really happy that uh, just something was done. It, it, it kind of feels good. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah. Because of our coverage, the Louisiana Fair Housing Action Center asked Toops to share his story to Louisiana legislators, hoping to pass House Bill 160, expanding protection for 1.4 million renters statewide. It's very difficult when your parents lost everything, your friends and family lost everything, and you gotta, you gotta find a place to go when there is no place to go. There's no hotels. There's no U-Hauls. The bill passed unanimously in both the House and the Senate. And if it becomes law, landlords wouldn't be able to claim units were abandoned within 30 days of a federal disaster declaration and renters could get double their rent back. It's heartbreaking to, to see that people are losing all their belongings um, and then also being kicked out. State Representative Mandy Landry authored the bill. She says many Louisianans have been pushed out of perfectly livable apartments by bad landlords after storms. We saw a lot of bad apple landlords after Ida and, and Laura who were trying to use those hurricanes as an excuse to get some insurance money. And it just puts people out of their home at the worst possible time. As a new homeowner, Toops knows this won't protect him this hurricane season. Seeing that this was the worst experience in our entire lives <laughs> is an understatement. But by sharing his story, he hopes it will make sure other renters in his home state and beloved bayou will have time to recover after future storms. The bill is now on Governor John Bell Edwards' desk. A date for potential signing has not been set. In Denham Springs, Devin Bartolotta, Eyewitness News.